Hey, Coach Justin Chamnus here, ShutUpMoney.com. The weight of regret is far heavier than the weight of discipline. But why is discipline so hard? Let's talk about that right now. It's been said before that people in nursing homes oftentimes will answer the question, what is it about life that you could change at this old stage, this old age? What could you look back on and change? And they always have some type of regret. I wish I would have spent more time with my kids. I wish I would have paid for college. I wish I would have quit that job and changed careers. I wish I would have never lost that lover. I wish I would have never done this bad thing, or I wish I could have done this. I wish I would have taken a risk. Regrets are heavy. Regrets are very heavy. Regrets are like a piano on your back. They will totally crush you. Discipline, however, while difficult, is not quite so heavy. But you see, it's easy to excuse ourselves from what feels like both discipline and regret in the moment. It seems though we've escaped both discipline and regret. There's no need for me to be disciplined enough to accomplish this or be productive like this or do this today because I don't really have any regrets about it. But one day, all those regrets will come crashing back in. What will you do then? I'm suggesting to you that accepting the responsibility of being a disciplined and productive individual each day is by far a lighter burden than to carry the burden of regret, knowing that you've missed essential opportunities, things that could have really fulfilled your purpose in this life. Or maybe you've burned bridges with other people and you just never made it right. And now it's too late. So here's your exercise. Stop putting things off and develop the discipline Do it because you want to avoid the regret. Do it because this is the one life you have to live. Do it because everybody else is waiting on you. I'm Coach Justin Chamness. ShutUpMoney.com is a great place for you and me to meet. I like you. So I'll see you here again tomorrow. Bye-bye.